show just got through doing Where in the World is Matt Lauer? Where in the world has Mo Green been? And we have some answers for you. It's been no injury, but he stumbled, and he has waited all this time to get started for the outdoor season. And Maurice Green, one of the athletes winning the Triple Crown, Olympic gold medal, world champion, and world record holder all at the same time. Maurice Green did dominate the sprints in much the same way as Carl Lewis did back in the 80s. But it's a long road back for the 32-year-old, and he decided he wanted to start here. Dwight, 100 meters. And I think a smart, smart move. Uh, go back to Carl Lewis's days. Look how fast he was down the runway. Sergei Bubka, the great pole vaulter, was invited once to compete on the Soviet national sprint team. He was that fast in the pole vault. So Phillips working on his speed here for the long jump. Cleanly, Maurice Green, a pretty good start down in lane two. Joshua Norman got out very, very well. In lane five, that is Dwight Phillips, and Green is way behind. It is going to be Josh Norman and Steve Mullings of Jamaica right in there as well. But Mo Green not looking good at all. He will not be advancing to our final later. And you know what we're seeing, uh, Dwight? We're seeing from him right now the same limp that I saw two years ago. I don't know if it's a, I, it looks to me like it'd be the same area of injury, the same leg, um, you know, maybe it's just not coming around. Watch Mo Green, he doesn't really get out well from lane four, he is struggling right away. Doesn't have that dynamic lift that he always had early in the race, and it just is not there. So it looks wow. like Mullings and then Phillips at the finish. This Let's take a look at the results. Remember, the top two finishers automatically moving on, and it is Steve Mullings of Jamaica, then Dwight Phillips. So we will see them in.